hey guys welcome back to my youtube channel if you're new you're more than welcome to join the family so don't forget to hit that subscribe button as well as the notification bell Ooh, okay so today i'm going to be showing you guys how i make banga stew um now this is the one that's eaten with rice popularly known as ofako especially among the Igbos. Um, but yeah, I'm just going to be showing you guys how I make mine, especially with limited access to fresh ingredients. But yeah, so I'm going to be boiling my meat and I'm just going to be using some red onion, seasoning cubes, salt, as well as cameroon pepper, which is optional. Then I'm also going to be adding my stock fish just so that it can soften as the meat boils. So just stir it and then cover and allow it to simmer. So now I'm going to be adding some water to this and this depends on how thick you want your stew to be. So I'm also going to be adding the palm nut extract just following the water and then I'm just going to stir and allow that to just melt into the pot. So after that I'm also going to be seasoning this which you'll see in a second or some seconds. <laughs> So yeah, after getting all that in there, I'm going to be adding my um, scotch bonnet. Followed by ogiri okwe. Now this is one of the important ingredients um, that I use. If you don't have ogiri okwe, you can actually use iru. But yeah, I use ogiri okwe. Then I'm going to be adding some of the smoked um fish you can go with cat smoked catfish or smoked herring and then i'm going to just stir and allow to you know to boil to simmer also i'm going to be adding some crayfish before i forget and at this point you can also add cameroon pepper or whatever um you know you would like to add again but yeah that's basically it and then i'm just going to be adding my fish before we cover and allow to simmer so yeah i'm using the basa steak um i prefer using this fish if not catfish because i don't know i just prefer this fish but yeah i'm going to be adding that and just try to tuck it in very well just so that as it boils you know everything gets you know all i don't know the word to use but yeah so yeah just put that in and then cover the pot and allow to simmer also to know when your bagasse is ready the oil should have risen to the surface like you'll see in a bit so just keep boiling until the oil rises to the surface and usually it takes about 10 minutes for the fish to be fully cooked so yeah don't overcook it if not your fish will scatter in the pot and yeah so i'm also going to be chopping some spinach and fresh spinach and then i'm just going to be adding it to the pot this is optional um actually but i like adding the fresh spinach um you know to just give it a bit of greenness life i don't know i don't know what to call it but yeah and i'm also going to be adding the scented leaves the scented leaves were the ones that I actually added first so I'm going to be adding the dried scented leaves af after um washing and then the spinach and then just for cook for about two minutes extra and your stew should be ready so you can enjoy it with rice or whatever you would like to eat it so thank you guys for watching and i'll see you in my next video guys bye